All right, a little bit of a treat for you today. I just got my new GT3 from Titleist. Uh, it's not released yet, but we've got fit for these a few weeks ago. And uh, I, drive, I drive it really well with my TSR3, so I wanted to make a video comparing between the two because the theory with this new driver is that the metal is a little bit faster because it's lighter, which means I'm gonna get a little bit more ball speed, so I wanted to test that. Uh, these two drivers are the same length. I go 45 inches just for control. Um, shafts are of similar makeup, both extra stiff, similar weight. Uh, this is the new Tour AD. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to give it a try. The, in the, uh, the TSR, I have the Ventus Black 6X, and uh, I, I've loved this driver. So I'm, I'm really curious what the numbers are going to be. Um, I'm going to be hitting uh, Pro Vs, so we'll be getting some really, really good numbers with this. All right, first drive. I hit that one really good. So that's 109, 165, pretty good strike, 274 in the air at 2400 spin. I would say that's a pretty, a pretty normal drive for me. I'm swinging a little slow of late. It's been so hot here, I'm, I feel like I'm swinging a little bit slower. Let's do another one. Try to ramp up the speed. Yeah, whenever I was getting fit, I definitely was a couple miles an hour faster with the, uh, with the GT versus the TSR. Yeah, I hit that one good too. So that is 109, 164, club path zero, very, very neutral. A little bit of toe, which is a pretty normal miss for me. 3,000 spin, 270 in the air. Uh, that one went 293 total. The one before went right at about 300. Uh, but again, yeah, pretty typical 109 club head speed. I'm not trying to kill it. I think I'm just kind of gaming it right now. Let's go again. Yeah, I hit that one even better. Yeah, well, I hit the same. So 109, 164 ball speed. Very center. 270, 293. I think we're seeing a pattern of about 109, 164. Now, those are all pretty center. It's a little spinny. That was a little low on the face, a little spinny. 3,100 spin, so it only went in 295. Let's see if I can hit one a little harder and hit it a little better. I hit that one pretty good, yeah. So that is 109, 165. Very neutral delivery. 281, 310. Okay, I think that's good. It's about 275 to 280 in the air with that one. That was the peak at 310 total. So this one is exactly the same. So these two drivers are nine degrees, same setting, same length. So we'll see what this one does. New driver, so my peak on that one was 109. I like to kind of draw my driver. Ooh, I hit that really good. Okay, there we go. That was a little bit different. Wow, okay, so that was 111. 166, 277, 313 with 1800 spin, pretty low. And I hit that very, very center. 111 is interesting because my peak with the uh, TSR was only 109. To get 111 with that is kind of eye-opening. Again, I mean, that's, that's kind of the point of these drivers is they keep making them to go faster and faster. So I'm intrigued that that went 111. I wonder if I can get a little bit more. I did try to hit the TSR on one of those hard and it just kind of came out at 109. I wonder if I have any more in the tank. Well, that one's 112, 168. Very, very center strike at 288 in the air. So, so far I'm seeing a two to three mile an hour gain. That one was 312 total. And I like that I'm not having to necessarily swing a lot harder. I mean, I feel like I'm swinging the same, honestly. And I'm getting 112 versus 109. Okay, let's do another one. Oh, I hit that good. That is one, 112, 167. That's a 149 smash, center strike. 285 in the air, 2200 spin. That's exactly what I'm looking for. 314 total. 
Yeah, I would say so far I'm seeing a great improvement. Nothing wrong with that. Again, I'm using good balls. These are Pro V1s. That's the ball I play, 167. Let's see if I can get one to 170. You know, just, just for fun, let's go back to the TSR, just because you might think, well, he's getting warmed up. I did warm up before I started doing the video. Okay, same intent. I'm not swinging any faster or slower. I'm just trying to hit it the same. Yeah, it went down to 164.9, 109 club. And I can promise you, I'm swinging this, I'm trying to swing the same. That one went 285 in the air, 308 total. The spin was pretty low, but again, I mean, that, that's probably just a happy coincidence. I only got 165 ball speed on that. I'm still getting two to three miles an hour faster with this one. Okay, let's do the, the new one again. Yeah, I really like, I love when getting fit when you don't have to swing any harder and the ball tends to come out faster and you swing faster without having to. Again, th there's nothing really with the length of the shaft. It's really just the way this head is designed. It should be going faster than your current driver. And I feel like I'm swinging the same. I mean, that is gone. That's 167, that is the exact same swing. 112, center strike, club path one right. Yeah, 287 in the air, about 315, 2400 spin. It's fantastic, I love it. Here we go. I'm gonna hit this one harder, or try to. That felt really good. It's 167 again. 112, 167. These strikes are all pretty darn center. Uh, 275, 306, I launched it a little low. It was a little low on the face, but that was a little low on the face and only spun 2477, so that's fantastic. There you go. Man, these are all going right down the middle. 113, 168. That was a miss hit right down the middle. 166 ball speed. That's another really important key is like, you're going to miss hit your driver. That was low toe at 270, 270 in the air, 300 total, 2,700 spent, and I pretty much hit that on the bottom of the face. Oh, wow. 113, 169. I stayed a little bit more flexed on that one so I wouldn't tow it. 285, 318. That was pretty fantastic. Okay, let's do a hard one. Yeah, I, I'm signing off on the GT for sure. Let's try one more here. Let's see if I can hit this 115, 172. Ah, 169. 113, 169. Well, I think that's all I have in the tank today. It is about 102 out here right now and I've been coaching all day, so maybe I'm a little slow. Yeah, pretty good numbers on that. I'll take 169. So again, if you're in a market, I would definitely check this out. Um, just check with one of your Titleist fitters in your local area and they'll definitely get you dialed. And I can promise you this, if, especially if you have an older generation driver, if you don't have something within the last couple years, I guarantee you the TSR would go further, but for sure the GT, this is twice now I've hit it. It definitely goes two to three miles an hour faster club head speed, which is gonna translate to, you know, four or five miles an hour ball speed which is what I was seeing today at 169 peak versus 164, 165. So definitely check it out. You know, reach out to me if you have any questions.